today's video, we're gonna create a world's first that's never been done in Fortnite. I'm gonna put myself in the game. Yeah. Well, you guys might ask yourself, yo, shoot it, how are you gonna pull this off? Well, make sure you guys go drop a like and stay to the end of the video to see how I was able to put myself in Fortnite and create this banger montage. Now, this video needs to be the most insane video I've ever made because it's gonna be a part of Flea's 20 editor collab. Now, let's just say in the past, yo, <laughs> the best thing I've ever seen. We gotta one up and make a banger. Now to pull this off, we're gonna open Blender and start modeling our environment and start adding in props, our character, and adding various lights to help with the scene. For this scene, I wanted to do a first person view shooting out of the portal right before I shoot the enemy. Animated the character running towards the door while the camera panned into the enemy. Next, I filmed myself in the first person view, peed myself out, added a major color correction and a light wrap to help blend in with the scene, and this is what I got. Next, it was time for the main scene. To create this flyby shooting scene, over in Blender, I gave Bay, I mean, I mean enemy, uh, a, a dead animation. Now, to implement myself into the scene, I went over to my green screen studio and tried to replicate the animation as if I was flying by. Now, this is where things go wrong. With my low budget setup, I could not figure out how to get myself fully on the green screen. There was countless times it would actually key me out also. And also getting the camera angle correct with the shot was difficult because I'm 2D in a 3D scene. So I went to extensive measures and decided to rotoscope myself out frame by frame. Now this took forever, so please drop a like to replenish the hours I spent on this. Once that was finished, I started compositing the blender scenes, tracking myself to the video, added a nice fatty color correction, added that catch up overlay and the extra sauces and it was done i wanted to create a scene as if the point of view was me actually playing the game now the first method was actually to content aware fill the character out and then replace it with me and let's just say it, it, it didn't work it, it, it didn't work uh, back to blender we created a new POI, added in lights, added in our new shoddy, I mean bay, I mean fence. So we animated the camera, had the character run out of the building and do a death animation. Now on my end, I had to figure out how to run in place to make it work. Let's just say I'm a genius. Next, inside After Effects, I combined the scenes with myself, lined up the position as you would see if you were actually playing the game, put the two layers in 3D space. We also added in some special sauces in the Fortnite HUD, and this is how it turned out. Whoa, instead of showing you a preview, why don't I just show you the whole thing? But before we do that, make sure you guys just hit this like button right here. It takes two seconds out of your day, and I appreciate it a lot. So why don't we just click it real quick? Nice. All right, here we go. Let's do it. Now I present to you, me and Fortnite. Yo, you guys trying to play some Fortnite? Fortnite? Oh. Dad? <laughs> Alrighty then, I'll just go play by myself. Oh wait, I forgot my pickaxe.